how to reduce decimals in Notion. In today's video I'm gonna show you two ways how you can do it. One where we're gonna write everything and the second one I'm gonna show you our website which one will do all the heavy lifting for us. So let's go into my computer. Okay we are on one of my templates which I create for myself and which is available on the internet. I'm using personality to plan my shopping and meals. At the bottom I decide to add a price tracker and basically I want to go to the shop and I want to see if the price of the product went up or down and what's the difference we have a price we have a new price and then we have a difference and that we're gonna get in the percentage first of all we need to create the formula new price minus a price and we're gonna close that in the brackets and now we need to divide that for a Price. and then we're gonna add another bracket so is everything gonna work fine and as we can see we have a percentage but this one we don't want so long numbers we just want single digit first way we need to go to edit property then edit formula and now we will need to do round add one more bracket so we have three brackets at the beginning then we have new price minus price close bracket divide for price close bracket and now we need to do star or multiply by 100 close the bracket now divide sign and 100 and now done and it went to 19 percent so now for example if we're gonna change this price to don't know 255 it's gonna show us that the price went up by 50 percent now let me show you the second way how to do it using a website so we're gonna delete that so we have this formula as well but now let's the website do all the heavy lifting so what we need to do we're gonna need to copy our formula we need to go to the website honorandprofit.ai i'm gonna put the link down in the description paste our formula and now you need to select how many decibels you want it to be round up basically zero decimals one or two you can enter the email but i wouldn't do that and now all what you need to do is get updated formula and it's gonna give you the formula but what i find out is that if i'm gonna come and paste it it's gonna give us those two numbers and I think that's where there's a bit of issue with that uh, website. But anyway, it does all the heavy lifting, as I said. All what you need to do after is just come here, delete two zeros. And that's how you're reducing the decimals in a two easy ways in Notion. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.